All right, welcome back, everybody. Another great match about to come at you. We've got the Baltimore Burgers hot off their 6-2 win over the Honolulu Hootenannies 9-4-0 on the season, going up against the St. Louis Storm 10-2-0, live from the Burger Palace in Baltimore, Maryland. And for the Baltimore Burgers, if they win this match, they are guaranteed in the top eight and in playoffs for this placement season. A top eight finish will also mean a promotion to Pro Division. The three teams currently locked in for Pro Division are Clappers, Storm, and Fishermen. As you can see, many teams are currently out, including the Ogres, Lotus, Kraken, Cows, Pepe, Tactics, and Boston Barrage. So let's take a look at the lineups here tonight. For the Burgers, they will most likely go with that same lineup again of Ocelot, Walster, and Delvich, though they do have Renard if they so choose to use him. And for the Storm, they have Jack, but it's most likely going to be Reno, FSI, and the SPL goal leader, Rodeo, taking the helm. Just type in a message to Rodeo real quick. Is this the same password for this lobby? It isn't. I, I need lobby password now. Also, you guys forced me to mute the bot. How dare you? Thank you for the password, Renard. Do appreciate it. All right. We are in, so let's send it on over. Of course I'm unmuting it for the game. Who do you think I am? All right. Baltimore is in red, and St. Louis is in blue. Not forget to close Chrome. Good point. It is now closed. Goodbye, Chrome. Everybody say bye, Chrome. <laughs> we got some big Osloff fans in chat. It's hard not to be a fan of them. <laughs> now, Balucha. Hey, to be fair, who wouldn't wake up for this great set of matches today? Or I guess tonight, but still. As I guess we're waiting for Wallster here. Hello, Meat Sale. Yeah, Meat Sale will ban you. <laughs> He'll mess you up. Alright, looks like Wallster might be ready here. Maybe. Possibly. I just noticed that the arena is still set to random. Oh, 
Pelvidge is cringe. Okay, there we go. Arena set to indoor. Everybody's ready. Let's get going. Burgers versus Storm. Like I said, if the Burgers pick up a win in this one, they clinch their spot for playoffs and pro, pro division. The Storm have already clinched both. Playing for seeding now. Back behind the net. Rodeo and Walster fighting. Rodeo comes away with it. And Rodeo dumping it all the way and hitting that cross ice goal. MVP chat or chance. As that is the 50th goal for Rodeo on the season. The first player to reach that mark. So congratulations to him. As he comes away with the puck on the boards. Gets it back to FSI. It bounces off of Delvage. And back to Rodeo. Rodeo passing it down to Reno. Reno going for the shot. Blocked by Ocelov. Now Delvage. Trying to go for the cross ice snipe. Blocked by FSI. On the boards. Delvage and Rodeo. Rodeo sending it towards net. Walster comes away with it. Now Walster and FSI fighting on the boards. FSI comes away with it. Gets it to Rodeo who just hits that shot. Beautiful play from the Storm. In the Burger Palace. Very hyped. Last match. It can get a bit hyped now as Walster puts that one in. Two to one. And now one goal game. Good play there from the Burgers. Now FSI in front of the Burgers. Net loses control of the puck. Now back behind the Baltimore net. Delvich. Loses it to FSI who gets out to Rodeo who just misses on the pass to Reno. Could have been a great play there for the Storm as Ocelof will dump it. Back behind the St. Louis net. Reno is there. Reno saying it down ice to Rodeo. Rodeo. Can't get full control of the puck before Ocelof sends it away. And now I'm... I don't even know how that worked. I'm going to be real. But Rodeo gets credit for the goal. More MVP chance for him. Already a hat trick for him in this one. 3-1 to one our score. And now Delvidge and FSI seem to be stuck to each other right now. All right, looks like they have become unstuck off camera. That's good. There's now Reno back behind the Storm's net. Sends it around. Boards up to Rodeo. Rodeo goes for a shot blocked by Walster. But collided with his own teammates, so nothing came of it at the other end. Ocelof keeping that puck away from Rodeo. A good idea. If his three goals so far are anything to tell you. Ocelof shot a bit weak. Easily saved by Rodeo. Now Rodeo. Loses control of it on the boards. It goes back to Walster. Walster sending it over. Trying to get to Delvich. Rodeo steals it. And now in front of the Baltimore net. It bounces off of four different players it seems. And eventually FSI is able to find the back of that net. Four to one now. Now Reno. Trying to get around Ocelov. Can't quite do it. Or Delvich. Going for the across or the mid line shot blocked. And now Reno with a bit of a mistake there. Bounces that one back towards his net. And Osloth is there to put it in. 4-2. to two. Our score. Now Walster comes away with that puck. But can't keep control of it. But Delvich. Back behind that storm net. Can't control the puck. Side dumping it to the other side. Walster taking control. For a passing opportunity. He loses control of the puck. Delvish gets control of it, though. Tries to bounce it towards the net. Reno is there. Now Ocelot with a nice pass down to Walster. Walster. Trying to get that pass out to a teammate. He eventually gets a Delvich who puts that shot in. Beautiful shot from Delvich. And just like that, it's a one-goal game once again. The fans here at the Burger Palace trying to inspire that first period to come back. Four to three. Reno 
taking control of the puck in the St. Louis zone with a nice pass over to Rodeo. Rodeo going for that shot just wide of the net. Now FSI getting a nice or trying to get that pass to Rodeo, but it was blocked by Walster. And Walster on the boards. Bring it back for Delvage. Delvage now with Rodeo on him. Just trying to keep that puck away from him. Look for a pass opportunity. Sends it up. Boards. Reno is there and he puts it into the Boston net. Or sorry, Baltimore net. Five to three. A two goal game once again. Now Walster trying to dump it away. Rodeo is there. Osloff now gets it past. Rodeo can't get past FSI. FSI on the other end. Bit too weak on his shot attempt. Now Delvich playing a risky game here in front of his own net. He eventually loses it to Reno, but Osloff is there to cover. And again, it gets sent out in front of the Baltimore net. This time it's Rodeo with it. Gets sent back to FSI, who dumps it back behind the Burgers net. A high score in first period here. 5-3 to three our score. Already the same amount of goals combined in this one that were in that last match the Burgers just played. Now Delvich is the puck in front of the St. Louis net. Blocked by Reno. Delvich trying to put that shot on net, but it goes wide. Now FSI gets past Walster. Gets that pass down to Rodeo. Rodeo now for the corner. Hits that pass to Chef Reno, who puts it in. Great team play there from the Storm. And it's a three-goal game once again. Six to three, our score. Now Delvich comes out to take that shot blocked by Rodeo. Rodeo on the other end blocked by Delvich, and that will end the first period. Once again, six to three, our score. A three-goal lead for the Storm heading into the second. Let's take a look at that last goal here from the Storm. FSI bringing it down ice, passing it to Rodeo, who hits that pass on Reno. A beautiful play by them. And here we go, second period underway. Oregon player having the time of their life. Delvich with a risky pass. It works out though. Gets the Ossoff. Off. Ossoff off, trying to get it down to Walster. And Reno sends it away. That's how we will start this second period. Delvich again with the puck back behind the Baltimore net. Trying to get that pass out to somebody. Doesn't quite work out. Gets the pass back. That risky pass to Ossoloff almost goes into the Burgers net. Now Delvich steals that pass away from Reno. Tried to get it down to Ossoloff, but Rodia was there to stop it. Now Walster with a great pass to Ossoloff. Ossoloff gets around Reno. Gets it back to Delvich, but Reno was there to make the save. Couple of good chances here for the Burgers as Rodeo almost own goals on the other end. Now Reno, the puck from back behind the Storm's net, gets up to Rodeo. Rodeo getting past Ossoloff, but Ossoloff comes back up to knock Rodeo off that puck. Keep him from putting it in the Baltimore net. Ossoloff at the other end with FSI and Rodeo on him. Gets around FSI, now has to get around Rodeo. No, instead pass it to Walster. Great pass and a great move from Walster to get it into the storm net. Six to four, our score. A two goal game here in Baltimore. Now Delvich is going for that cross, a shot blocked by Reno. Walster taking control of the puck. I'm not sure what the hell he was thinking there. Leaves an open net for FSI at the other end. And it's a three goal lead once again for the Storm. Now Delvich losing control of the puck. FSI trying to get that out to Rodeo. But he cannot put it in to the Burgers net. Now Reno does a good job to get past Osloff, but cannot get past Walster. FSI and Delvich. Delvich coming away with it. Now Rodeo losing control of the puck to Delvich. He gets it to Walster. Walster with a nice pass to Ossoff. Ossoff gets it around Reno and puts it in. Beautiful play there for the Burgers. And it's a two-goal game once again. Seven to five. Goals back and forth here for the Storm and the Burgers. Now Rodeo going for that cross ice attempt. Blocked by Ossoff. Blocked by Rodeo. Now FSI gets around Delvich, but Delvich does a good job to stop that shot attempt. 
FSI almost had another one, but he could not corral the puck in time. Osiloff trying to get it past Reno. Can't quite do it. Reno shot just off the side of the net. He sends it around boards. Rodeo is there. Rodeo goes for a shot blocked by Walster. Now Walster can't quite get full control of the puck. Rodeo. Dumping it into the corner here. Getting it out to FSI who sends it right back to said corner. Now Osiloff just sends it away. Or Delvin, sorry, sends it away. And Reno trying to block it. Redirects it towards his own net. 7-6. to six. Now Delvich going for the across ice shot blocked by Rodeo. The Burger Palace coming back alive here. <laughs> MVPs for I don't even know who. Now Rodeo's cross ice attempt misses. Osloff bouncing off boards. Walster just trying to dump it. Blocked by FSI. FSI can't get that pass to Rodeo. Rodeo does come away with the puck, though, eventually. He gets it to Reno. Now that bounce does not work out for the Storm. And instead leaves an open net for Walster. And now, with three unanswered goals, the Burgers have tied it up 7-7. Seven to seven. Now Delvich back behind the Baltimore net. Pass up to Walster. Walster can't maintain control of it. Rodeo hits that shot from the other zone. Eight to seven. MVP. Rodeo misses on the shot attempt there. As Baltimore's attempts to tie it up are short-lived. Now Rodeo with a nice pass over to FSI, but he cannot redirect it towards the net. Now gets sent out in front of the Baltimore net. FSI and Walster pinch to send it away. Reno sends it back in. Now Delva trying to send it away. And again, Reno gets on it. Gives it over to Rodeo. Rodeo, lose control of it, but FSI gets control of it. Walster was there for the nice stop, though. Now Walster has an open net as he finds a way to sneak it between Rodeo and Reno. And we're all tied once again. Eight to eight. Baltimore may be trying to take their time here, worried about touching the puck at this point. Want to hold this tie for as long as they can. As Ocelov from the boards, and with that nice pass over to Walster, who can't quite get it on net. Now Delvich, back behind the Baltimore net, gets it around FSI. But Reno comes up to keep it away from Walster. Walster's trying to get back to it. Losing control of Rodeo. Rodeo just dumps it into the Baltimore zone. Under 20 seconds left here in the second period. Delvich pinches it away. And gets it all the way to Walster with a nice pass over to Ocelov. They made this play in the Hootenannies game and they do it again. To take the lead with 11 seconds left here in the second period. 9 to 8 our score. Now Rodeo getting it around. Ossoloff cannot get it past Delvich as time expires here in the second period. Ossoloff dumping it away. And 9-8 to eight will remain our score going into the third. Baltimore taking a one-goal lead off this beautiful goal we need to see again. They've made the same play in the Hootenannies match. Pinch it around to Walster. Give it to Ossoloff and let him shoot it in. Just like in the Hootenannies match, he does not miss. The Burger Palace getting hyped as we get ready for the third period. Nine to eight, our score. If Baltimore picks up this win, they clinch their playoff spot and will be making their way into Pro Division next season. Oregon 5 does not exist. <laughs> not yet, at least. That one exists. As here we go, third period, about to begin. <laughs> Some bad lag here, unfortunately. 
It looks like we're good now. And now back behind the storm net. Delvage and FSI fighting for it. Delvage? We get around FSI here. Didn't quite do it. Now Walster's turn. Gets it past Rodeo and dumping it back behind the storm net. And 9 to 8 our score. Rodeo gets that puck. Trying to get past Delvage. Can't quite do it. Delvage at the other end. Blocked by Reno. Delvage trying to pass it up to Walster. Doesn't quite connect. Delvage shot, or Rodeo shot, sorry, blocked by Delvage. Now Reno goes for shot from the midline. Not quite on target. Now Reno shot just wide of the net. Things have seemingly slowed down a little bit here in this third period. Rodeo getting that pass down to FSI right as I say that, but also off of a nice block. Now he blocks Reno's dump attempt, but Reno gets past him. Cannot get past Delvage, though. Now Reno with two burger players on him. Just has to give that one back to Rodeo. Rodeo trying to dump it away. Blocked by Delvage, and now Walster's shot attempt. Redirected by Rodeo. FSI gets around Walster, bounces it up boards. Right to Ocelof. Ocelof's dump attempt blocked by FSI. The Burgers hoping to pick up a win as Delvich sends it out in front of his own net and leaves Rodeo an easy goal. 9-9. Nine to nine. MVP. Even in Baltimore, Rodeo's got fans. Now FSI. Try to get that pass out. Was blocked. Rodeo eventually getting to the puck here, though. Osloff trying to keep it away from him. Rodeo kicks it back, but Delvage sends it away. Now Rodeo for a chance at the open net, but he misses just barely. Now FSI pressuring Delvage here. Comes away with the puck, gives it back to Rodeo. Rodeo gets it past Walster, trying to get that one up to FSI, but Osloff was there. Osloff losing control of the puck to Rodeo. The pass to FSI could have been sent into the net. But FSI cannot get enough power on it. Now a nice pass from Ocelot to Delvage. Delvage somehow sneaks a shot off there, actually. But it goes off the side of the net. And now Reno. Just dumping it into the Baltimore zone. Two minutes and 30 seconds left here in the third period. And we're all tied up 9-9. Nine to nine. Now Delvage. Bounces the puck off boards. Rodeo is there to bounce it back. Now Walster cannot get it past Rodeo. Ocelot loses the puck to FSI. FSI now. Trying to get past Delvage. Delvage comes away with the puck, though. But FSI steals it right back. The two of them fighting back and forth here. Eventually, FSI gets that pass back to Reno. Gives it over to Rodeo, who dumps it back behind the Baltimore net. Delvage sends it away right to Chef Reno. Two minutes left here in the third. Reno gets that pass down to Rodeo. Rodeo misses on the pass to FSI. He goes back to Reno once again. Also off pressuring this time. Gets that pass out, but this time it's blocked by Delvage. Delvage. Trying to bounce it off boards, but it goes right to FSI. Who gets it past Delvage, gets it around Ocelot to Rodeo, who gives it back to Reno, who does not corral the puck. And Delvage bounces it off boards and into the St. Louis net. Giving the lead back to Baltimore with a minute 39 left to play with. Now FSI almost immediately ties it back up. But Delvage was there for the save and he hits the across a shot to make it a two goal lead. 11 to 9. MVP coming out for Delvage. The man who didn't even have a team to start this SPL season has clearly found a home in Baltimore. Now Ocelov trying to get around Rodeo here. Does. Looking for the pass attempt, but it's sent away by Reno. Now Rodeo. Get over to FSI. Two-goal lead for the Burgers here. Looking to clinch a top or a spot in top eight. As Rodeo gets an open net and he doesn't miss. He has plenty of goals in this game. I don't know how many. 11 to 10. As correct me if I'm wrong, but I think this is the first ever SPL match where both teams have scored double digits. As Rodeo has a chance to put it in, but was blocked by the Burgers. Can the Storm tie this one up? 40 seconds left. Osloff comes away with the puck. Gets it around FSI. Cannot get it around Marino, though. Now, Walster, if a chance, sends it wide of the net. Reno, trying to get away from Delvich. Can't quite do it. Rodeo gets it away from him, though. 
Takes control of the puck. Under 30 seconds left here in the third. Nice pass to Reno. Blocked by Wolster. But it bounces off of Delvich into the Baltimore net. And with 24 seconds, we're tied. Now Wolster. Pass over to Delvich. Delvich misses on the shot wide. 15 seconds left. Can either team get a goal or are we going to overtime? Radio gets the puck. Sending it down ice, blocked by Delvich. Delvich with five seconds left. Loses control of the puck. Walster just wanting to keep that one away from Rodeo. And we have overtime in Baltimore. 11 to 11, our score. Now, Baltimore does not clinch with an overtime loss. However, they would clinch with a win here. FSI almost puts it away right away, but he's blocked by Delvich. Now, Walster, giving that one to Ocelov. Ocelov, bouncing up boards. It goes right to Rodeo. Rodeo with a good opportunity here. Goes for a shot wide of the net. The Storm pressuring heavily here. As Delvich and FSI fighting. Delvich with a risky pass attempt. Goes right to Rodeo, and he puts it in. 12 to 11, our final score. St. Louis wins in 